How many times have you said to yourself, why am I paying so much for TV service? We found that we were asking ourselves the very same question. We'd run into some salesperson at Costco or the county fair. We'd get some screaming deal for a period of time for service and a DVR. And then we'd have to do verbal WrestleMania with the customer service when the contract expired and our price went way up. For a number of years, I worked for a cable TV company and the marketing guys always talked about how digital cable was conceivably perceptively better than analog, which admittedly it was. But what they wouldn't tell the customers is that over the air digital TV service is far better than satellite or cable. We've also found that over the air service to be available when we traveled to almost any destination in our RV. Plus, I don't have to set up the tripod everywhere we go. So, once we replaced the original Batwing antenna with our new King Digital antenna head on the existing crank up mast on our motorhome and used the built in signal amplifier, we have found that there's more than enough quality TV available to us over the air without need for cable TV or satellite TV service. Next, really all we needed was a DVR. So, for a couple of years, we used the Magnavox DVR. It worked fine at recording. But the interface for accessing the catalog of programs was a little rudimentary and didn't allow for any grouping of programming by the name of the show. So for the price of a couple of months of cable TV, or comparatively the price of a Magnavox DVR, we bought a new smart TV, a Tableau TV tuner, and a USB hard drive to store all of our recordings. It also has the added bonus of working with up to six internet connected devices, which we can use near our home. So we can also watch TV in our bedroom as well. This setup has worked great for us. Though it does take a minute or so to boot up when you first turn on the Tableau device, we love the way it groups programs as well as the channel guide. The Tableau device does always require access to the internet for the first startup, but all it does with that is download the channel guide. So when you're on the road to your RV, you simply use your cell phone as the Wi-Fi hotspot to satisfy the Tableau. Otherwise, when we're home, we simply use our regular internet connection. We did find over time that our USB hard drives don't always like to run constantly and get warm and can burn out. So with some aluminum channel that I got from Lowe's and a small cooling fan, I made a heat sink that draws the heat away from the hard drive and from the tablet device and keeps everything running cool. We've been using our new setup for a couple of months now and we love it. Have safe travels everyone!